Okay, in uh, this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do um, some changes to a body to make it look more fit. Um, on the stage here, I have some model in a bikini uh, that appears to be in shape, but uh, if you're really picky and, and want to make slight changes, you can. Um, <clears throat> So find find a picture of yourself or whoever you want to you know edit. Open it up in Photoshop, which I have already done. And then you are going to simply go to Filter and Liquify. Actually, before you do that, you might want to make a uh, duplicate of that layer, just so you can see the changes that are going to be made. <clears throat> Alright, take the copy layer, go to filter, liquify, and that comes up. Uh, we're going to pick the forward warp tool, and you want to take you know your brush and make sure it fits into the cursor body. You don't want it too big, you don't want it too small, and you're simply just going to take it and click right there and just kind of move it in just a little bit. So she looks a little more slim. And then you're going to repeat the same thing on this side. You want to try to get close to the body because if not, you're going to start pulling the arm in. So I might make my brush a little bit smaller for this side. And you go right in the body and pull it in just a little bit. That's all you need. So as you can see, she's already looking a little more slim. You can do a little, couple a little more marks here just to, you know, modify that a little more. There you go. You can do that to legs, whatever. Um, you can see already it's uh, looking pretty good. And then, if you want, you could, uh, and there's this tool here. It's called uh, Pinch, <clears throat> the pucker tool. You can come to, this, you know, get a little brush of your brush. That's a little too big. Come in here and just pucker up the stomach a little bit. You don't want to go too extreme on it because it starts to get distorted and it looks bad. And then, if you want to, you could take the extrude, the bloat tool, and obviously we're going to need a smaller brush size, but you can go here and enlarge the breasts a little bit to uh, so eh, that brush is a little too small I'm gonna go backwards get a little bigger brush size go over there make those a little bigger so they fill out a little bit don't want to go too extreme <clears throat> that looks pretty good right there. And then you're going to click OK. It's going to bring you back and make the changes. And then to see your changes, just take this and hide this layer. And you can see just that little bit right there completely changes the whole body. The amount gets skinnier, a little tighter, bigger boobs, completely changes it. You can hardly tell. And that's that. Uh, that simple. Alright, well, uh, stay tuned for more tutorials coming up. Um, and don't forget to subscribe. Uh, and see you in the next video.